Hello, welcome. Welcome back if you're a current subscriber. Welcome if you're new. I know, I still have up my Christmas shower curtain. So I'm just finishing getting ready. April is almost here. So we're gonna do a little sniff session. And I haven't met April in person before. She lives local, um, about a half hour from me. Um, and we're gonna sniff through some scents. And then we are going to head to Sassy Girl Aromas ribbon cutting ceremony and open house. I'm super excited. I've been talking about this for a while. So I hope you enjoy this vlog. All right, hello guys. Uh, this is April. Hello. So I've told you that we are planning this sassy girl aroma trip for what, like months now we've mm -hmm. been talking about this because we've been waiting for her, to, Julie, to announce that she's going to do it. So literally we can see the store right here. We're like two cars down. I'll flip the camera on and show you, but um, April came over early and we did kind of like a sniff oh, yeah. session and that was fun and did that. I told her she needs to come another time cause we had to leave by 10. So we wanted to make sure we got here and got a picture and see if Julie's around and I have to probably pee. <laughs> so maybe she has a bathroom. Um, but this literally looks like every downtown Wisconsin like little right I'll show you a picture of the street here but literally when we pulled up I was like this literally looks like every little town's downtown mm -hmm. oh look I wonder if that's for them oh I wonder if that's ribbon like cutting. the ribbon cutting yep. the ribbon. so we've got like 15 minutes what time is it now 11:38. yeah so we've got about 20 minutes so I know I think we can go in yeah I'm sure it's I think it's open at 10 or was it not open though oh they're trying to open the door and it's not open see I think she technically isn't opening until the noon mm -hmm. oh. Oh. so we can oh I bet you she did for them see it's probably their chamber of commerce oh I'm sure it is I kept couldn't remember that word though chamber of commerce I'm gonna roll this down as we're sitting in here I'm warm um, now you're gonna hear traffic oh well um, but we're going to go and get a photo by it, but we'll do a selfie and then I'll ask someone to take a picture. I hate selfies. I'm like terrible. It's like, I don't like my face super squished in. It always makes in. my neck go away. I know. Like I look like I have 16 <laughs> chins because of how you have to take a photo. So we are going, I'm going to vlog some. I don't know if Julie will like let me vlog her too. Probably. We'll see. I think we're going to call Michelle. Hello, Michelle. <laughs> Um, she wanted us to FaceTime her, so can we, fa oh yeah, we can do video yeah. FaceTime on Instagram. So we'll see. We'll give that a try. Yeah, we don't have any schedule, like, we're just kind of doing whatever. Mm -hmm. So we could take a walk, we could do whatever, and then come back and shop. I, I just told my husband, like, I'll be home when I'm, be I'm home. Me too. And the drive wasn't bad, actually. No, I think it went really quick. Yeah. And I've been here before. So you can come again. Yes. <laughs> I'd like to come before Christmas. Like, maybe when the roads aren't terrible, terrible. And November? Make a yes. I'm good with that. Because mm -hmm. she'll have Christmas and all that kind of stuff up then. So we haven't seen anything yet. We didn't. I'm like, we're, we're so excited. We're well, I am. Yeah, well, I am excited too. Like literally, like this is like me going to Chippewa's candy store because I have. A, have you been to their candy store down there? Yes. Time? I know. So good. It literally is like you Willy will. Wonka. It's candy store and Olson ice cream. Oh yes, it's a lot of sugar. I my kids love going there, but um, it took us a minute to see her sign because I wasn't sure what logo she'd have because she's changed so that much. Logo. So that's interesting because it's the floral one. I think I have brittles like that. But so now her new one is the girl. Yep. So I was I was wasn't sure which one she was gonna do, but it looks like it's a floral sign. I love the brick. I do oh, love the brick. Oh. We'll show you the building, but um, so we're gonna go get some photos. I need to pee because I drink. Quick trip wasn't that far. I know, and it honestly though I saw right at the end of the block they have public bathrooms, which is interesting. So I wonder if these businesses don't. Oh, well, maybe not. Because like, I mean, some of the stores downtown Chippewa don't have bathrooms either. So I wonder because when they're busy, I saw like a nice area though at the end of the block that was, but um, maybe she'll have a bathroom. All right. I don't know that she's going to be open before noon though, but we might. In 20 minutes. Well, we can see if the door opens or not. Otherwise you can just take a photo and like walk back to the bathroom yeah. too. Um, but we'll do that. Get up so, the bathroom support. Well, for me, I, um, so sorry, I was getting a message from my boss. That's always great. Um, so we'll check back. <laughs> Let me see if I can zoom out now. Can I zoom? What'd you do? Can you smell it? <laughs> I can't, like, smell the wax, I swear. And it's frosted windows. Want to before we go in there? Yeah. Oh, 
I like that. Wow, I really like those. try to eliminate at least the construction portion of my life and when we did that it really took off uh, so quickly that we ended up hiring two employees my brother being one of them Forrest and Ashley Julie's daughter being another one uh, within the first year I quit all my jobs within the first year and it blossomed into doing that at home and then taking over our home and then, <laughs> Uh, John Kenworthy kept telling me to come down and look at this place. His wife, Chris, is uh, works for the Boys and Girls Club, and, and he kept saying you need to look at it, and it took me like a year to do that. <laughs> and finally, we decided we needed to look at that, and the rest is a little bit of history. We moved in here almost a year ago and started working, and now getting the, getting the storefront going. So, it's a huge transformation. And, yes, and, and we've added two more employees since then. Wow. Shane and Alexa, and so we are still growing, hopefully. <laughs> and then you have future plans for making another location somewhere? Um, possible. <laughs> We're going to leave it at possible. <laughs> She's shaking her head. Sure. <laughs> Nodding her head. Sure. Um, no, you've got a great uh, location, great neighbors. I've seen some of the blocks coming over here. Yep. So, you know. Yeah, no, it fits right in. Talk a little bit about how to order online. That was cute. decided yet. <laughs> and then what are you anticipating store hours will be here? Um, Monday through Friday is going to be 10 to 5 and then Saturday 10 to 3. Okay. Um, <clears throat> one thing I noticed was all of the fragrant games. So how do you come up with those? <laughs> They're very creative. Um, well, actually some of my online customers has named yeah. quite a few of them. And then I have come up with some. I, I, I don't know. I just Google some stuff. I put a couple words together. I know you don't like pumpkin waffles, but... Well, I don't mind it. Is, is it... Oh, you... I have... You don't have that? I used it all. 
you gonna you're gonna do a video and I'm gonna do a video. I'll watch your video. Oh no, <laughs> you should. Oh my gosh. I love that. It is like Well you you know what that one smells like. Oh I love that there's so many shapes though. I know. <laughs> shopping for the day so <laughs> we actually kind of did pretty close I still beat her which is fine next time I'll win yeah I don't know because then <laughs> next we didn't kind of know what to expect or what they would have so I, she didn't have beach nights just saying and no cupcakes at Tiffany's I was sad about that so we kind of hassled Julie and Terrell like <laughs> we need these you should always have these scents because they're very popular um, but we did find some fun scents that maybe you will enjoy. What is this one again? Oops, my camera's over here. Special brownies. <laughs> and then, mm, that's not for me. And then devil's lettuce. So if you like these kind of scents, she does have these. I was, those are for gifts. I was also happy about these little <gasps> mini loafs. And that scent is amazing. Barbie girl, bubble gum and cotton candy. We both got this. We both did. It was so good. So we had a lot of fun. She had mm -hmm. quite a lot of people, I think. We stayed, I think, the one. We were there a long time, and they even commented on that. But hey, we drove, like, <laughs> how many hours? I mean, it was an hour and a half, and I'm so indecisive. I literally can't do it, man. I Even with pre-orders, I'm terrible about that. I literally ordered on the last day. That's why I probably get my order last, because 
I literally ordered the last day. It was nice to be able to smell, smell. and re-smell, and then we took a little break and had some refreshments and gave our noses a break, and then we went back and re-smelled, which yeah. I liked. I thought that was nice. It was, and we just really didn't have any expectations of this trip because it's the first time we went, and we just really didn't know how it would go or what she would have, so I think it was that part we were just kind of being open. Um, and then afterwards, we had lunch at this cute little park here. I didn't see if it has a name, but we had lunch at the park. And now we're going to head home and probably smell this as we're I'm not going to smell it because I'm driving. It won't be like, hey, you want to smell it? <laughs> we had a good time and we are planning on going back in November. Mm -hmm. Hopefully not on a snowy day if we can help it. But she does have regular hours here in Toma. Um, I don't know if you're close or how far, but I think it was a great time. I can't wait to see if she does Christmas shapes. I like know. And trees. she had a lot of shapes. Which oh, yeah. are, if you want to show I think I did. I got this one. It's a uh, blackberry jam cookies. I got the oh. I got the boring like shapes because my my not boring but in the sense of like That's a scarecrow. I think. Oh, this is a scarecrow, and then this one was the donut. Um, but she had lots of them. You'll see in the video part that I put in here. She had I did a video of the shapes and all the things she had. There was a ton. She had a good selection of I think all scent, cat scent categories. I mean, there were so. some in there that I was like, no way. But I appreciate that she did like a combo of everybody's scent preferences. There was Christmas stuff too. Even. There was so and many all, yeah. good. But I think if she would have had, well, we talked to Julie and so she said um, about pre-orders next time that she will hold some for us. Yeah. So I'll find out the details on that because if we're planning on coming, I'll ask her how long she'll do that for us. Because that would have been better if I could have had her hold some pre-orders and then we would have got the actual scents that we wanted versus Maybe I didn't spend as much because there wasn't as many scents, but I also got scents that I wouldn't have bought without smelling them, so that was another bonus True. of us going. There was a couple of things yeah. you got that you wouldn't have gotten. I wouldn't have but gotten based on scent notes, and you'll see that in the haul. But that was really fun, and again, I mean, I wouldn't be opposed to coming back even if, honestly, I wouldn't be opposed to October and November. I'd be fine with that too. I mean, it's an hour and a half away. I drive to the cities, and it's the same distance. So for me, it's, I mean, even when I drive to see my sister, it's 40 minutes from my house. So, hour and a half here, 40 minutes to see my sister. Like, I don't care. Um, I wonder how often her scents change out. Like, oh, in the that store. would be the thing, yeah. So, maybe I'll ask her, too. Like, I wouldn't be opposed. But Terrell said that they are going to alternate them based on the pre-orders, too. Okay. So, so I think. Just wait till yeah, no. He said he would. they'd be moving things in and out. So, I think that's helpful. Um, but it was... It seems like they're very family focused business. A lot of family working for them, which is an amazing blessing. And I just, everybody was so nice. Mm -hmm. All their family was chatty and helpful. And well, we probably, I think they were laughing at us a lot. I think they thought we were going to move in. Yeah, I think <laughs> they might have thought we were going to move in. I really was trying to like persuade them to let us go in the back and see what they do oh, for boring. I, should, I didn't ask, but I should have. I was like joking that I was going to create a distraction or have April create distraction I was going to run back and watch <laughs> them but I, I didn't do it and I didn't want to be like can you please let us see how you pour because um, maybe next time I'll be a little bit more bold but I just didn't know how they would be or if I would like be annoying to them or like that crazy lady. I thought it was funny when you walked in they're like we know who you are and I'm like I know you're not talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> so Julie obviously recognized me yes so that was nice and like I said you'll see I'll insert some photos as well in this little vlog um so you'll see kind of our day and our fun we called Michelle mm -hmm. which she liked I probably should call her on her way home again um but that was nice that she was she wanted us to call her and we did so yeah we went through some scents and yeah. showed her around the yeah store. I showed her around the store and um so maybe next time if you want to get a phone call let me know and we can do that too I I kind of set her on the shelf and was like I hope this doesn't fall as I'm talking to her and trying to show her and smell scents so that was really fun but it was just overall nice that we have a vendor that's close to us and that we could act like we were kids and literally her daughter said you two are like kids in the candy store April's like sitting on the floor and I'm like <laughs> smell this and she's like smell this and I'm like smell th wait smell this wait smell this and we were literally I mean it's okay yeah. I, I don't mind if I embarrass myself I've done a lot worse so it's okay I yeah, I didn't care. I, just I didn't sat, care. It, sat on the floor and was looking through all the it stuff was on so my basket. Fun. Make sure I didn't miss anything. We had so much. Fun. It was literally like two kids, literally yep. in a candy store. Mm -hmm. Adult version, right? But like, it was so much fun. And so the, the, your car smells amazing. <laughs> yeah, my the car smells great. Like I have. Oh, but I need that blueberry rush. She, I have the blueberry burst. It's oh, not blueberry, blueberry rush. It's blueberry burst. burst. Oh, God, smells good. So if anybody has pods, let me know because. 
more April wax. and I need more of this because I only have one bar in my club and then I don't have any more of the pods, but that was from my Easter collection. I know everybody hates it, but I love it. I liked it. I, it's so good in the wax too. And I only have one bar left. So if you have any in the pods or the wax, let me know and I'll hook up April and I and you know, let me know. But all right, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And with that being said, I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Bye. Bye.